All right, meteorologist Steve Davis and the Weather Pros live at theblocks.com. We're taking a look at the next couple of days here. And we take a look right now. We have a stationary front laid across the southern parts of Virginia into Kentucky with a low pressure system in North Carolina. This is good for especially the fire range getting a little bit of this rain. But this low will be fluctuating back and forth. And we can see this uh, get dry tomorrow. And then reform for Wednesday, coming back through the area as a warm front, setting up for the next cold front coming through by the time we get to the day on Friday. Or Thursday night and Friday. As this cold front moves through, and we dry out for the day on Saturday. So Saturday's going to be a nice day. Then we have a system here, and this could be a severe weather issue, with a low pressure system sitting out near Arkansas and parts of. Missouri, this thing will move to the east and a little bit to the northeast. What that'll do is put the low pressure system in West Virginia, giving us a potential for severe weather. Uh, and we'll take a look at those, that information here shortly. I don't know why the sounding viewer came up. We then will see this thing move off the coastline, and we will dry out for a couple days before we get the next very strong uh, low pressure system moving in by the 1st of May. And that'll move through the area, and we'll be set up again for another high pressure. Let's take a look at the uh, threat for severe weather by the time we get to Sunday. Currently looking a couple days out to this uh, threat on Wednesday, I mean on Sunday. We do see that we have an LCL, and a southeast to southwest movement. We do see we have a little bit of uh, turning with height. And we do see that the potential type is hazardous tornado. And so we do have that potential, like I said. And a lot of this is with the STP actually going up to 1.5 already in the models. This could be something interesting we need to watch for Sunday. Like I said, there's going to be a lot of rotation based on the fact of that low pressure being so close. So right now, uh, we'll keep an eye on it. Uh, won't get worried about it or anything right now. But we will be keeping an eye on it. Because the chances are we may see a chance of a uh, tornadic thunderstorm or at least some severe weather on Sunday. Until then... We have an off and on, showers, and thunderstorms, and the cool air damming will, will be putting the wedge in place for Wednesday and Thursday. So until then, that's what we have to deal with. That's what we have for now. Meteorologist Team Davidson, thank you for watching. Have a great one.